are some exciting coming attractions from Paramount. The men who fly the A6 intruders in Vietnam are as calm in the air. It's going to be the most exciting thing you've ever done with your clothes on, Doc. Oh. <laughs> as they are on the ground. Jake. Yeah. Razor. Got room here for a six pack and a pizza? Sure, say lord. Okay. Yeah. Cole. You got the DFC and the Silver Star, don't you? Does it matter? Camparelli. I got that name because somewhere in my past there was a wop in the wood pile. Nerve made them confident. <laughs> the rules of engagement held them back. What's your problem, mister? Well, I don't think trees in a suspected truck park is worth a man's life. <laughs> They send you here to stroke the widow. You get in your airplane and fly away alone. Sometimes you don't come back. I'd like to introduce you to the replacement crew. Why don't we just call them new guys? Oh! You used up all the good names. I don't like the targets either. I hate them. You tell me you're interested in payback. It's right across the square from the National Assembly. Sam City, man. Just say we happen to pull it off. Maybe some other guy somewhere would get a chance to die in their sleep. <laughs> Heroes, you don't have the right to make up your own orders. This war has become very confusing. Maybe for me, it got personal because I do know the difference between dying for something and dying for nothing. You know what's going on back home. Riots, people spitting on soldiers in airports. The whole country's tearing itself apart. All we really got is each other. Let's go downtown. Danny Glover. Yeah! You know something I don't know? Willem Dafoe. Brad Johnson. I grounded you. Hey, I am on the ground. Rosanna Arquette. Hey, me here. You got a chance alone. You're going back to your wife and kids. Flight of the Intruder. In the dead of winter, two desperate criminals escape from prison near the Canadian border. Some believe they perished in the woods. Hey, I found them for you! Sure, if you know who these are. Caroline has found our lost priest. This is Father Brown and Father Riley. But who would believe that such a small town could make such a big mistake? You don't look a thing like your pictures. Fasting and prayer. Now, they've got a profession to fake. Bishop Nogolich points out it's his turn to say the grace. Let, let him read it. It's his turn. I don't want to get in anybody's face here. A confession to take. I've been sleeping with this woman. Huh? All right, and what? You're not married to her? No. You married with someone else? To my wife. You like know about this? No. Well, what are you worried about, though? Forget about it. A woman to win. Yeah, well, you don't like the guy. What'd you go to bed with him for? For five dollars. What, and you got five dollars? I'll go to bed with you, too. What, you think that's a sin? Actually, I got five dollars. Get out of here. And a future to plan. Give some booze and some prize and this country can just buy you. Robert De Niro. Father, I've been shot. <laughs> I'm very happy for you. Sean Penn. Be nice to strangers, because sometimes you're a stranger, too. This is not a fitting grace. What's wrong with it? We're no angels. He says that there's something uh, wrong about you. Yeah, you tell him he don't know the half me. Now available on video cassette. I need women. I need drugs. I need drink. I need something, man! It was supposed to be an ordinary prisoner transfer. I'm a federal agent, and this man is my prisoner. So, brother, I am just like you, a prisoner of the system. But this... What can I bring you? How about a hacksaw? <laughs> Only kidding. <laughs> ...was no ordinary prisoner. I went and slipped some acid in your mineral water. <laughs> what did you say? Hey, don't you worry. I'm not gonna let you trip alone. I dropped a couple of tabs myself. In the next two days... 
John Buckner, FBI, oh, cute, will have his identity stolen. You know, you look like, you look like me. John Buckner, FBI. His freedom taken away. Wait till they find out how I escaped from the feds. His career destroyed. John, we don't like to look foolish. <laughs> and he owes it all to one man, <laughs> oh! Huey Walker. You know what your problem is? You like me, but you won't admit it. 20 years ago, he wanted to change the world. It takes more than going down to your local video store and renting Easy Rider to be a rebel. Today, he'll settle for just one guy. They flushed my head down the toilet. Oh yeah, well blame me for everything. Dennis Hopper, Kiefer Sutherland, flashback. Once we get out of the 80s, the 90s are going to make the 60s look like the 50s. Coming this August to video stores everywhere. And now we're pleased to bring you our feature presentation.